beautiful people. This tutorial is about the Soft Glam palette by ABH along with the Embreezy highlight. I'm going to do a nice little subtle yet beautiful look for you guys. So here we go. I'm gonna first prime my face and I'm going to prime my face with the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Primer right here. Prime, prime, prime. Welcome, 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 everyone. Hope everybody's having a beautiful, beautiful day. And I am Sheila She's Beautiful Earthen. Please, if you're watching this video, subscribe to my channel. I sure love to have you. All right, I primed my face. Now we're going to do my eyebrows. Let's see. Let's brush these bad boys up. As you all know, I am letting my eyebrows grow back in. So they're going to start looking like little caterpillars. I'm going to let them grow back in, and then I'll shape them up afterwards. Hi, Pamela. How are you doing, honey? Hope all is well. Now I'm going to go in with some concealer. Well, not the concealer yet. What am I talking about? Hmm. My day going a little bit too good. Okay. Let me get my little concealer brush to shape up these eyebrows. And also let me get. My pomade, my pomade I'm going to use by Ulta, the brow pomade. Honey, I'm doing fine today. I've got the new palette, Soft Glam palette, and the Ambrizy, what's Ambrizy eyeshadow, the highlighter, and the Glam palette. going to try to do a little look for you guys today. Hope you guys like it. Tell all your friends to come be friends with me. I surely love to have them. Thank you all for getting me to 200 subscribers. I ain't there yet, but I'm trying. Y'all help me out a little bit. But let's get into these brows. I'm going to be looking over here to my camera over here on the left and also my mirror. Hey, Big Sex, I ain't see you last. My last uh, laugh, honey. You doing all right? Getting these brows together. I really don't like this color on these brows. Oh, thank you. I try. I'm going to try to slay this time, too. I'm going to do my best. And if y'all see anything going on wrong, please let a sister know. I love critiques. Especially when they're helping me out. Y'all pray for me on these eyebrows. They are really getting thick. I'm going to go in with my black color because I like it better than this one. So I'm going to use the Morphe in, is in shadow. I like them better. The other one's in dark brown, which I don't really like because my eyebrows are actually black. So let's do this again. Go in a little bit. And I really get them together once I get the look together like I want it. Then I come back in and hook my brows back up.
I don't have to work today. So I said, why not come in here and stay a little bit? I'm so excited about this palette. I've been seeing so many tutorials and they just had me all just, just ready for this palette to get in here, to get in my mailbox. Well, I sure will, thank you very much, I sure will. You know I always enjoy. I'm in overtime, so I'm glad about that. But I was like, don't call me tomorrow or the day after. Y'all got one of my days. Hubby said he want me to be at home with him today, so that's what I'm going to do. She with my eyebrows growing in so thick. I'm going to get somebody to do them tomorrow. I'm going to try. I got to find somebody. Shape them up since they done grew in so much. I was thinking about doing it myself. But I was like, nah, I'll let somebody else go get pampered a little bit. Let somebody else do it for a change. Let somebody else do it. Never had nobody to really do them for me, so why not try? There's some other hands on my eyes. So far, so good, though. Okay, let's get some concealer up there. Kind of bring them together. Let's see, let's see, let's see. It's a shame to have so many brushes. I'm going to grab my pink dot brush from BH Cosmetics. Going to get a little shape going. Clean them up a bit. Mm. Not too bad. I was getting ready to take me a nap, and I heard a knock at the door. After I just got through saying, by the time I lay down, here they come. And I didn't even lay my head down on the pillow good, and he was knocking at the door. Act like he didn't want to leave. Hey, can you give me my box and get out my door? Let me sign this paper. Oh, this little call calm thing you got in your hand, and you can keep it moving. Hey, man, I know how to hold a box. Move. I mean, you got it? No. Do you got it? Still. In your hands. Let go. And delivered it and I got home somewhere. They coming together. I usually would like to get my brows off camera. You know, brows take a little minute.
I've been having a really good week this week. No complaining on this end. Still got another week, probably before my blood sugar palate gets here, unfortunately. But I'm waiting. Let's get these brows set with my Ulta Beauty Brow Shaping Gel, which I'm just using this to set the brow. It's a nice little gel too. Pam! I see you still there, girl. I sure appreciate you. I got somebody on here. That's all that now. If I don't get but one, I am satisfied. But if anybody else is watching, please push that subscribe button. I surely will appreciate you. Now, let's go on in here and prime my eyes again with the Tarte Shape Tape in Deep Concealer. Put it on with my finger first. Then blend it out with my brush. And this brush is from Morphe. It's the, from the Sculpt and Blend Collection. I think it's uh, the 504 set. Just what the brush looks like. It don't have a number on it, it just says Morphe. So let's get that on there good. And I do this other eye. What's the other coming? Let's see. I got a new purple. I saw half of it. It done disappeared on me. I saw it. I got a new purple, but then that's all I got. It'll probably pop back up on me. I gotta learn how to keep my eyes on this screen. Oh, shoot. Purple. And that's my favorite color, too. Purple. I love me some purple. What's the purple uh, lip gloss by? Who's it by? Who's it by? We set these eyes. Well, it's purple anyway, so they, that's all that matter. Long as it works for you. I love me some purple, honey. Okay, now that we got our eyes set, we're going to go into our palette. This beautiful, it's shiny, girl, yeah. I like a good shine on a lip gloss. But here's our palette. It's the Soft Lounge by... ABH or Anastasia Berry Hills. Move this little plastic out of here. And this is what the palette looks like. Let me keep this, move this brush. This is the brush. And there's the palette. It is beautiful. 
It's got those colors that you can pretty much wear on an everyday basis. If you just do regular uh, shadow, you go to work or daytime, nighttime, it's for any time. So, this palette will probably be worn quite often. But you know me, I like a lot of color too, so, hmm. But I'm about to make this palette work today, honey. So, we're going to go into the transition color called Dusty Rose. And it's right here on the end. So, I'm going to grab my little blending brush. This is by Morphe as well. This pretty little brush right here. I love these brushes because they're so soft. Got a good density on it and they're very soft. So, we're going into Dusty Rose. Tap that in. Right above the crease. It don't show very much on my skin, but that's all right. Because it is the transition color. And I will use another one a little bit below that. So, y'all going to see it come together. Don't worry about it right now. It's going to come together. I can see it pretty much. I like it. Got a little bit of fallout. Just a little bit in there. Not too bad, though. Not too bad at all. Okay. Now we're going to go into this color called Sienna. Okay. Right below it. Right into the crease. Yet, still above the crease. Color is really pretty, too. Got a nice little fallout in this color, though. But it's to be expected in a lot of palettes, so... Really nothing to worry about. Windshield wiper. Okay. Not bad, not bad at all. Other eye. I don't do a lot of tap off because I want that eye shadow. I ain't gonna waste it. I tap a little bit, but I ain't trying to waste my Shadow, I'm going to use the little bit that's falling off, too. We're going to make it work. Mama going to work it out. Mama going to work it out. See that? <laughs> yes, Lord, it's coming in there. They blend so smooth, which I love. I have this one. The Modern Renaissance, which is my holy grail. And I have the Anastasia Prism palette, which is very nice, too. I was going to get the sculpt, uh, what's that, sculpt, sculpture palette? I don't know. It kind of scared me on that one, but I still may end up getting it just to try it out for myself. Sometimes you just can't be listening to what folks tell you. You got to do what you got to do for yourself. Okay, now we go going a little bit deeper, and I'm going to go into this color called Mulberry. Yeah, Mulberry, which is right here. Put it on an outer crease and inner crease as well. Right along the middle, right here. And within the crease as well. Okay. Who are these colors? No, they so smooth. Almost near the middle, but 
also in the crease. See that? Very pretty. Very pretty. Got some fallout going on there. Okay. Now, I want to do this black color. Get another brush. I'm going to use, hold up. You know what? I'm going to try this Anastasia brush. I don't usually use these little brushes, but I'm going to try this brush. And I'm going to try this black color right here, and it's called Noor. I think I'm saying it right. And I'm going to put it right on the outer, right there. Oh, thank you, honey. My husband be coming in here with all these different headbands. He have headbands with the roses and all the different little colors. He had red and blue. No, you know what? If you squeeze your eyebrow, you'll notice that there's not a whole lot of filling in your in your eyebrow on that on the end. It's it's the about, about the numbest place on the eye on your head, pretty much. If you just kind of squeeze it a bit, you, you notice that you don't feel a whole lot of pain. Not a whole lot. It's bearable. I had my tongue pierced. Cat ears? What's that? How do you get cat ears? I can't imagine. I think my ear is pointed enough. I don't know if they consider it pointed. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Mm -hmm. I can't imagine. I need to look that up. I was thinking about piercing my, my little dimples. My dimples come in when they feel like it. Sometimes I see them, sometimes I don't. <laughs> Oh, okay. That I look is coming together. Hey, look at that. What's going on with this lighting, though? Kind of weird. Let's see. No, I don't want to do that. Let me see. Maybe this light over here. It does a little bit better. I don't know. I don't know. We'll get together. But I got this going on. These colors are so smooth. I just love this. They blending out so amazing. Ooh, huh? Then I met with the wrong one with this pack. This black is wonderful. If I can just get this black by itself, it is nice and smooth. It blends. This this little brush is pretty good. And these colors aren't smearing either. They going on nice and smooth. Mm, mm, mm. Now let me go back in with rose, let's see, mulberry. Go back in with mulberry right above that black and blend that in some more. Blend those colors in together. 
Smooth it out. It's really coming together. I love it, love it, I love it. Okay, now I'm going to go back in with Sienna. Kind of soften that up there. Nah. Nah. Let me get these palettes out of the way. Small cut crease. Not much. Just enough where I put this color on. It will show very well. Hey, Sean, honey, how you doing? I'm doing this little glam look with the ABH Soft Glow Palette and an Amreezy Highlight. So right now, I'm doing just a little cut crease, just a little bit. I'm testing out this palette. I've been looking on YouTube at all the tutorials and watching how these people been really throwing down with this palette. I had to have it myself. So far, it is really good. It's very good. Nice and smooth. The colors go on so smooth. I know that's right. Take it one day at a time. It's my off day, so I decided to come on YouTube and film this tutorial. Well, thank you, honey. I'm going to try. I'm, a, uh, I'm trying to get me somebody to do my eyebrow. Shape them up for me. I let them grow all the way back out. That way they can, they can cut them right. Or clip them or whatever they do to them. I never had anybody to do my eyebrows before. So, they can pamper my eyebrows. Hope you can see this video pretty good. My light is tripping. I wanted to film by the window, get some natural lighting, but it's pretty gloomy out there today. So, nah. Now we're going to go into, let's see, which one should I do? I think I'm going to do this color called Sultry right here. Move this plastic out the way. I'm gonna use my other Morphe brush, this brush right here. I think I ought to spray it with some Fix Plus. These colors are amazing. 
starting from the inner corner out. Tapping that in. This palette retails for $42. And then on the web the website, there was, I think, $5. Probably some change to shipping and handling, so it was like 47, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. 48, something like that. I think it was 48 once it all boiled down. And it's well worth it. Okay, got that on there, real cute. Now, I think I want to go into bronze, this pretty gold color. I'm gonna use that with my finger. And tap it right in the middle. Well, I'll put it right here where the gold and the brown kind of come in together. Ooh, that color. No, it's pretty. Look at it. Ooh. Child. Giving it that gradient effect. See there? Okay, then we're going to go back in with Mulberry and condense the outside of the line on both sides. Mm. Now, I need a inner corner highlight. my little brush for that and I'm gonna go in with uh what does it say glistening this color right here put it on my inner corner oh that's really nice I'm gonna bring it out a little bit And I'm going to take that and go right up under my ooh, eyebrow, the brow bone, like she called it. Ooh, look at it. Ooh, no. Got to be careful. Move that out. Right now, I want to get another brush and smudge out that bottom water line with mulberry. Taking it all the way outside the um, outer crease as well. Giving that shadow some shape. And I'll blend that back out in a minute. I'm going to blend that. Nah. Came together very well. So, we're through with the palette. I'm going to get now my smudger brush. Well, I need still my waterline deepened with the black. Called Noor. Just to get my waterline a little bit. Well, not the waterline, the lash line. Let me correct that. It is much in the lash line as possible. I 
Okay. Now, to do my liner. This liner is by Ciate, my favorite. I haven't found a good one yet, but I'm sure I will. Going to do a small wing. Okay. Yeah, excuse me, my hand get in the way. Uh, no, I'm blind in my left eye. So when doing the right eye, my hand tends to get in the way. Let me deepen this one a little bit more. Sean, how is mama doing? And sweetie? Okay, now it's time to do this face. All right. Now, my Fenty Beauty. Put that on there on my little top. Let me get my foundation brush. This is the Morphe 450 M457 brush. Like that. Shut it all the way around. I want to get it all on my face. Put it on real quick. Stippling it in. That headline. Match up those ears. Leaning out nicely. Yeah, that's what I'm using. The Fenty Beauty Foundation at 440. I love it. My holy grail so far, that and the uh, Maybelline Fit Me does, does my uh, skin really good. It blends so good. Do you have the uh, Fenty Beauty too? Big sexy. Um, uh, I have 360 Mocha, 
and I have 375 Java. I have them in both uh, the Dewey Foundation and the Matte Foundation because my skin is combination. So some days I might be oily, some days I might not be. Mm-hmm. The Fenty Foundation, it looks different in the bottle compared to the uh, Fit Me Foundation. They, but they pretty much it's the same color. Just Fenty, it, it just mattifies and dries down pretty much faster than the uh the Fit Me does. The Fenty dries down faster. Now I'm gonna take my my sponge. Which I'm used to my sponge pretty much. Just go over my face a little bit. That in, tap, 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 tap. Okay, now concealer. Let's put this concealer on. This concealer is kind of light right here. This is my LA Girl Pro Concealer. Not in fun, which I'm about to grab in a minute. Well, I do my tart shape tape in a minute, which I want to grab first. But I'm gonna combine the two. This is a tart shape tape in deep. It's got that gold tone that I love the most. Okay. Now it's time to blend out. Back and forth, and back and forth, and back and forth. Ooh, is my stomach ground? Why every time I get the damn in my stomach get the ground? And I know I ain't hungry. I am not hungry. For all who are watching, please subscribe to my channel. I surely would love to have you. Blend that in good. Okay, let's get it set, and we're going to set with our Laura Mercier powder in deep. It's in, oh, got some on my face. They usually show it on, somewhere on here. Medium deep, I said it right. Get enough in that pan. Get these eyes set. Back and forth to make sure you get in there good. Now 
No, y'all didn't hear my stomach just growl. Did you hear that? Did you hear my stomach growl? It loud, too. I ain't embarrassed, shoot. But it ought to be satisfied. Don't make no sense. Hey, I'm not hungry. My husband just got through calling me, asked me, did I eat? Say, yeah, I had some good old toast and eggs. That's all I wanted. All I had a taste for. Not no bacon. We ain't baking this face. I ain't talking about baking this for <laughs> good eating. But I'm not gonna bake. I just want to set this in good. So far, so good. All right. We got that. Now, let's get into some bronzer. Now, I do want to get the Ambrizy bronzer. They got it in mahogany. But this here is in ebony. So, where's my bronzer brush? Bronzer, bronzer, bronzer. Where you at, baby? I love this brush. This brush is uh, by Ulta Beauty. Nice, beautiful brush. You're going to swirl that on. This is a beautiful, beautiful bronzer. It encircles that golden color real nice. I love it. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Look at that. Don't make no sense. It is my holy grail, honey. Cover girl, you came with them, honey. And I got me a backup because I'm hitting pan. Got to have your backup. That is beautiful. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Got to have your bronzer. Now, let me bronze my nose. Some definition on that nose. Look at that. Now, I'm going to deepen up my contour on my cheek, and I'm using the Morphe brush, the Sculpt and Blend brush, and I'm going into my TARDIS Pro Palette 3rd Edition in this color here, and I'm going to get my Walking Dead cheekbones. Very long in there. Thank you, honey. Appreciate that. Putting on my Walking Dead cheekbones, girl. Got to have them. This palette is wonderful. Girl, you need to get this palette. It's $42. $42. I'm telling you, not sponsored, but you need to get this palette. That palette is amazing, honey. Yes, it is. Mm-hmm. Girl, it's worth the money, though. Seriously, it's worth the money. We're going to deepen up this contour around my jawline, my chin. We got the nose set. Man, ha! We about to break into this Embreezy 
highlighter. Let's open her up. This is what she looks like. Excuse all the little fingerprints. She is black and gold trimming. Now I'm going to open her up. Let me move, put this box in front of it because it's got a nice mirror to it. I don't want to blind y'all. But this is the highlight in all of its glory. Got those nice little ocean waves going on. And we about to dip into it. I'm going to get, let um, see if I need to use my Morphe M38 brush right here. I'm going to try this for a chain because I never have used it. Because I usually use my other one. But we about to dip in. Well, you know what? Yeah, let me go ahead. Here we go. Ooh, yeah, it is beautiful and smooth. I know I can amp this up some more. Oh, honey, look at that. I didn't do no blush, child. But we ain't worried about it either. Mm, mm, mm. Look at that. Let me amp up a little bit more. Child, she is beautiful and she ain't ashy either. And I'm dog skin. She is melting into my skin, honey. With the greatest of ease. Put a little bit of up here somewhere. I like my forehead, honey. I like to glow to the gods. Give me a little bit on my nose. Put a little on my nose. Boop, boop. Yes, ma'am, Pam. Right in the center. Mm-hmm. This cheekbone. It is melting in my skin. It's like smooth. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful glow. And you can look ahead when you look like straight at the, the camera. You don't see that ash flow. You know, like you can just see it just sitting on top of the skin. It ain't doing none of that. Look at that. And you can build it up. If you really, really want to go glam or just be like pow, just out there, build it up. It ain't going to hurt nobody. You the one wearing it. I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. Look at that. Ooh, sitting on top of my little cheek. Look at that. Put my shine my little cheeks up. Look at that. Sam, let cheeks up. Mm, mm, mm. Put a little bit on my chin. My jaw a little bit. Just everywhere the sun just gonna hit. And let everybody know you're an angel up in here. A little bit up there. We'll put some up there. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Cha! It's melted into my skin. That is wonderful. And I ain't amping it up. I ain't amping it up. I'm just saying. Now, let's do a lip color. Because this highlight, I've been shot with a highlight bullet. Thank you. Yeah. I've been shot with a highlight bullet because that's not killed me. Let me see. What we going to do about these lips? Let me find me a good old let me grab my lip pencil. I done jumped out of camera. I'll be there in a second. And I'm back. Get this lip on here. Mm-hmm. Get my lip color. I'm going to use this Jeffree Star Dominatrix. I think that was called Dominatrix in Jeffree Star Cosmetics. It's a beautiful chocolate brown color. Mm, perfect with this color. This uh, makeup look I got going on. Nice. Now, 
We got that. Let me put a little gleam on top of my Cupid's bow. Yes, ma'am. Woo, yes, ma'am. You know how I do with a highlight, child. You know how I do with a highlight? Now, let me get my born in my face. Let me throw on some mascara right quick. They don't know, child. They don't know. They don't know, honey. Let me get these lashes straight. This bad guy bang or uh, something else, too. I know I probably shouldn't be talking about it right now. Because it's all about the soft glam palette, but honey, it done gave my lashes a life for real. It done gave my lashes a life. You want some your makeup to look like something? You better go with put some money into it a little bit. Sometimes. And sometimes the high end ain't as good as the low end, but hey. Sometimes you gotta spend a little bit to get that look you really, really want. But two, it's also how you apply. It really ain't about the price, it's about how you apply. It's how it look. You don't wanna be walking around with smooth or makeup. It's all about the application mostly. But I had to spend that little 42 one for that. Now get this last, these bottom lashes. Because you know I don't like to do no falses too often. I was going to film earlier, but I decided not to. This, this mascara is pulling at my lashes so good. Mm, mm, mm. I know that's right. You done put it, you done tried it on already. Sure, I love it. That Maybelline Falls is real good too. But this here took the cake. That in my roller lash. This one in my roller lash. Man. We in the building. Let me spray this face. With my Morphe setting mist. And this here is the finished look. And guess what? I'm under an hour. 58 minutes. I did a whole lot better than my last one. <laughs> this look is really cute. I can put a little bit more highlight on there, but I ain't going to do it. I ain't going to do it. But you like that look? Thank you. Hey, I really love this palette. This palette is beautiful. I done kind of got a little makeup on it, but you know what? Get your little makeup remover wipe and wipe over it. Come clean just as good. That's how I keep all my palettes clean. But I'm going to open it up let you see that again. It's pretty. It's something you can wear every day or night, either one. But it's amazing. It's truly amazing. And one more look at this highlight. Let me grab that box in. Ain't nobody trying to blind nobody. It's beautiful. I would never run out of this, pack, this highlighter. It hit pan. I'm going to give me a nut. Hopefully it stay in stock. Hope this ain't limited edition. But this is the finished look. If you like it, comment, comment down below. And if there's a, any other palettes or any types of looks y'all think I should do, you recommend any kind of makeup I should get and throw that up there and do a tutorial on, I am open for suggestions. Other than that, this is the finished look. And I am Sheila She's Beautiful Irvin 
Sign out. Till next time. Love you, Big Sexy, and Sean, and Pam, and all who got a chance to look at this tutorial today on the Salt Glam by AVH Cosmetics and Embreezy Highlight by Embreezy. Hey, that's it. You take care, Miss Big Sexy, honey. Sean, Pam, everybody out there, please like, comment, subscribe. I love to have y'all. Peace, love, and taco grease. Till next time.